हेलो फ्रेंड्स वेलकम टू माय चैनल माय सेल्फ पराग गांबुलकर इन लास्ट वीडियो वी हैव सीन हाउ टू इंप्लीमेंट वन टू मेनी रिलेशनशिप सो देयर आर टू टाइप्स ऑफ वन टू मेनी रिलेशनशिप वन इज मास्टर डिटेल एंड अनदर इज लुकअप सो इन लास्ट वीडियो वी हैव सीन हाउ टू इंप्लीमेंट मास्टर डिटेल रिलेशनशिप एंड लुकअप रिलेशनशिप इन सेल्स फोर्स इन दिस वीडियो वी विल सी हाउ टू इंप्लीमेंट मेनी टू मेनी रिलेशनशिप सो सी इन दिस एग्जांपल इन बिटवीन स्टूडेंट एंड teacher object there is many to many relationship what is the meaning of many to many relationship see in this case record from this object is related to multiple records in this object and any record from this object is also related to multiple records in this object this is called as many to many relationship for example in this case see one student can be taught by multiple teachers and any teacher can teach multiple students right and that's why there is many to many relationship between student object and teacher object right now see in selfos how to implement this many to many relationship that we will see so in selfos to implement many to many relationship we have to take help of third object and that third object is called as junction object see here in this case in our example we have to implement many to many relationship between student object and teacher object right and to implement this we have to take help of third object and that third object is called as junction object and also we have to implement two master detail relationship see in both this master detail relationship junction object should be child object here you can see junction object should be child object and here also junction object should be child object and see here our first object student here it is parent and again here our second object teacher that is also parent right so see to implement many to many relationship we have to implement two master detail relationships in which junction object is child object in both the master detail relationships and first table is parent here and here another table or another object is also parent here right so in this way we can implement many to many relationship in selfos now see to create junction object we will click on setup here we will search objects now see here we got this link create objects we will click on it now see here we have to create new custom object right so that junction object is nothing but a object only right so that's why we have to click on new custom object okay here so label will give student teacher this is junction object between student object and teacher object okay that's why we are giving name like this you can give any name plural label so same will keep now see we'll scroll down okay record name now see this is junction object right and we are using this junction object just to relate two objects student and teacher so that's why no need to take any input from the user so student teacher name which is default will instead of taking input from the user what we will do we will keep it at a number and if you want to take input from the user so in that case you can give text but see it is not required that's why we are keeping at a number and see display format so what we'll do We'll keep it same format so see here i am putting this and instead of this we can write something else so i am writing junction okay and it is starting from one okay so it should start from one two three four something like this okay now see so remaining thing we'll keep it default save so by this we have created one custom object student teacher right now see we'll scroll down here so see we have created one junction object now this junction object should be child object in first relationship and this junction object should be child in second master detail relationship right in last video we have seen in child object we have to create relationship field right so here we have to create a relationship field which is related to parent of the student and also in this relationship again at this junction object is child object here we have to create a relationship field which is related to parent object teacher right so see now we'll create this relationship field so for that here it is written see custom fields and relationship here we'll click on new now see what we have to create master detail relationship we'll scroll down and click on next okay related to what so see in first case it is related to parent object student 
so student here from this drop down we will choose student ok next fill name so we will keep same student remaining thing we will keep it default next ok so it should be visible for all the user profiles next we will keep default value next ok save so by this we have created our first master data relationship right so we have created this master data relationship again we have to create one more master data relationship with teacher object right so in this junction object only we have to create master data relationship field which is related to teacher object so see again you will click on new what we have to create master data relationship again we will scroll down next related to what so it is related to parent object teacher from this drop down we will choose teacher ok next field name will keep teacher remaining thing will keep default next ok it should be visible for all the user profiles next ok so the again remaining thing will keep it default next save ok so by this we have created two master data relationship right first master data relationship which is related to parent object student and second master data relationship which is related to teacher object right so we have added two relationship fields right in which table we have added in junction table student teacher now see we will click on student tab we will click on go so there is only one student added here right so see we will click on this ok so up till now we have not added any student teacher relationship here for this student right so see we will click on new student teacher ok so student name is Varad Joshi and teacher we have to add now see for student Varad Joshi teacher will add suppose Mayur Chavan again suppose we want to add multiple teachers right here we are adding Mayur Chavan again 7 new again second teacher will add suppose Paral Zambulkar again okay, 7 new and one more teacher will add Yogesh Hangi ok save so see for this student Varad Joshi we have added 3 teachers right see if I click on this I will come to know student Varad Joshi teacher Mayur Chavan right again this second uh, student Varad Joshi teacher for example correct now see what we will do we will add one more student student name so suppose I am giving name Akshay Kadam role number 32 department CE contact number something will enter college college suppose GCOE okay. save so see we have added this student and we will add student teacher relationship so see suppose Akshay Kadam is taught by teacher Mayur Chavan 7 new again suppose he is taught by teacher Parag Zambulkar again suppose we are adding one more suppose he is taught by teacher Yogesh Hangi save so see so here we have added three values right Akshay Kadam is taught by these three teachers right now see if you go to teachers so see for Parag Zambulkar if I click here Parag Zambulkar is teaching these two students right if I click here so I will come to know Parag Zambulkar is teaching Varad Joshi and also Parag Zambulkar is teaching Akshay Kadam right and if we want to add any new teacher so that also we can do so see suppose I want to add new teacher Manish Jansari department suppose C teacher id something 236 will enter staff room suppose i am entering something like this a305 save now see 
for this teacher Manish Jansari, there is no student teacher relationship, right? See, in previous case, we have added multiple teachers for student, right? As it is many to many relationship, we can add multiple students for teacher also, right? So, see, for this teacher, I am adding multiple students. See, new student teacher. So, for teacher Manish Jansari, I am adding student. Akshay Kadam. Again, we will add one more student. Varad Joshi. Okay, save. So, see, for this teacher, now there are two students, right? If I click here, first student Akshay Kadam, right? If I click on another value, so see, second student is Varad Joshi, right? So, in this way, we can add multiple teachers for one student and we can add multiple students for one teacher, right? So, this is called a many to many relationship and we have implemented this many to many relationship in self force by using junction object. So friends, I hope you like this video. If yes, then click on like, subscribe to the channel and don't forget to press bell icon so that you will get notification of my next video. So stay connected. Thank you.